Welcome back, guys, to Persona 5 Royal. The last episode, spending the night of September 5th with Oya to reach Devil Rank 5, we continue to use fortune telling to boost our stat gains, heading to Rathlesia to work for some more kindness, but not getting any request info. The day of our school trip then arrived as we flew over to Hawaii, having enjoyed a first day in the sun on landing as we now witness the rest of our stay. Nothing but Japanese people around here. I thought we were gonna be getting alohas coming from all directions and stuff. It costs money to enjoy that atmosphere, you know? There's not much we can do as students. I guess it's the same no matter where we go. Hey, what's with the low energy, Makoto? I just had to listen to the taxi driver complain for 30 minutes straight. I'm used to dealing with students' troubles, but I never expected to have to do it overseas as well. That must have sucked. We should be doing some more exciting stuff. I mean, we're in freaking Hawaii, for God's sake. Isn't the school supposed to plan stuff? I want to go diving! It seems there wasn't enough time to come up with any kind of coordinated travel plan. That lack of coordination is what led to them using students as chaperones as well. By the way, you're rooming with Mishima, right? How is it? Anything interesting? <laughs> it really is all fancy all the time. Even in Hawaii? Fan site. You know, I do hear people talking about the Phantom Thieves every so often. Are they really mentioning us? I think so. We've already made our international debut. Man, just talking about that makes me want to go back to Japan so bad. You really have no chill. Come on, let's try and forget about those things for now. But people are waiting for us to fix society. We don't got time to be relaxing over here. Ain't that right, Yusuke? Wait, what the hell? Overseas travel provides a great opportunity for new insight. I'd prefer we stay here a bit longer. What are you doing here? Wasn't your school supposed to be going to Los Angeles? Apparently, they couldn't land the plane due to a terrible storm brewing on the west coast. There were no signs of it letting up, so our destination was changed on the spot to Hawaii. Do you just bring rain wherever you go? Could it be that what happened at the fireworks festival was his fault as well? Don't go bringing any storms here, you got that? I'll do my best. By the way, there's nothing planned after this. What are you all going to do? Uh, oh yeah, I, I still gotta buy souvenirs. My mom asked me to grab some stuff for her. I totally forgot about that. We need to pick things up for Futaba and Morgana, too. I was hoping to do some shopping myself. Then it's settled. I wonder what Morgana would want. Man, our group's totally the same even out of Japan. Why would you change? <laughs> huh, I didn't realize Big Bang Burger was in Hawaii, too. Yeah, it's been getting real popular in Japan lately. I guess they wanted to branch out. Now that you mention it, I read a news article recently about the success of Okumura Foods. Ah, yes. The company that owns Big Bang Burger. Okumura? Ain't that the guy who's at the top of the fan site rankings? Is that true? I guarantee it. I don't make mistakes about that kind of stuff. Okay. <laughs> There's the arc beginning, is it? <laughs> I mean, good job. You know your burger tycoons. Right. Hmm? What's the matter? Oh, it's probably nothing. Just a rumor I heard about Okumura Foods. Supposedly, all of their overseas competition has mysteriously pulled out. Never mind. I'm surely just overthinking things. Sis's habits seem to be rubbing off on me. Hey, why don't we take a pic together? You know, so we can remember the trip and all. Ooh, good idea! <laughs> With the big bag burger in the backdrop. Wow, what a great pic. <laughs> we had peaches. <laughs> I could take the photo because I'm antisocial and I want to stay out of the picture. Are you sure you don't want to be in it? <laughs> Thanks. I only ask that you ensure the composition is well balanced. Ugh, can you not worry about that stuff for one second? Go for it. The realization that Futaba's just seeing inside my pocket most of the time. <laughs> Smile! Hmm, we still 
have some time to spare, right? Where to next? There's a convenience store down by the beach. How about there? That sounds lovely. I would quite like a short rest. All right, let's head over there. Hmm. Huh. Don't you think the food around here is kind of salty? You might be right. Oh, shoot. I forgot my sunscreen. I'm going to go buy another bottle at the convenience store. I'll go with you. I guess we will need to wait for them to come back. I'm so bored. By the way, you think we're the thieves everyone here has been going on about? It'd be pretty freaking crazy if that was true, huh? There's no way. Huh. I had not heard of such rumors. It sounds wonderful. But we are already here, so why don't we confirm if that is the case? Oh, good idea. Let's try asking around while we wait for Ron and Makoto. This is the case, then some weird crap's going on, you know? Well, I'm curious as to the extent to which people are discussing us. Hey. Let's try starting a comma with some ladies around here about the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Being given a tiny little area to run around in that's very, very penned in. Look. <laughs> oh, I've heard of the Phantom Thieves. In fact, I'm a big fan. It's so awesome how they kick the bad guys' asses. I wonder how they steal hearts. Oh. They actually seem to be quite knowledgeable. Dude. Damn, it's crazy how many people know about us. This is freaking awesome. Uh, you're not at all suspicious? Phantom Oh, like the ones from Japan. Whoa. Oh, I read about them in a news article recently. One of it. <laughs> That's actually all I wanted to know. Thanks. Honestly, people don't get Japan news fed this way. <laughs> Phantom Thieves? I've never heard of them. That's better. You kids are from Japan, right? Are these Phantom Thieves special people like Samurai or Geisha? Hmm. I suppose that understanding isn't necessarily incorrect for someone from a foreign country. Well, I can see who I'm going to talk to. Is now sat down next to us. Huh? Hey, ain't she kind of cute? Maybe we should ask her some questions, too. You don't recognize her? Uh, free time is almost up. Shouldn't you be heading back soon? They don't recognize her. <laughs> what about you? Oh, yes. <laughs> By the way, your blonde friends seem very excited on the airplane coming here. Hey, you're that girl we saw watering the plants. Sorry to surprise you. I'm another third year who was asked to come chaperone this trip. I accepted the task to take my mind off of things, but I wasn't sure how to spend my free time. We're here! I think I should be going. See you. Sorry, were you waiting long? Hmm. That girl you were talking to just now, do you know her? No, that was my first interaction with her. She said she was a third year, the same as you, Makoto. Mm -hmm. I've never really spoken to her, though. Ah, uh, it looks like our free time is over. Let's head back to the hotel. The f <laughs> oh, what am I doing? I feel like such an idiot for getting psyched for this. Then again, we are on a trip, so... Excuse me, Miss Kawakami? About the post-beach plans. Ah! Um, did I find you at a bad time? N not at all. What's the matter? <sighs> Found it. One after another, too. What did you find? Still working, can't tell you. <laughs> she can handle this without me. Ooh, so much. All I'm good for is driving them around in mementos. I'm basically useless. Kitty, your mumbling's distracting me. If you got something to say, just spit it out. It's nothing. What were you saying? Let me go! You feel so nice. I do not! So smooth and silky. It's kinda hard to believe fur this soft belongs to a human. Don't make me say it again. I'm a human! Couldn't you just be assuming that? 
I had the wrong assumptions about my mom for the longest time. It's not the same. I understand myself better than anyone. That's true. <sighs> there are even more posts now. Oh, wow. The president of a company called Okumura Foods is rising very quickly up the rankings. <laughs> You're looking now. Well, to be honest, it's nighttime, man. We're about to go to bed. This is the time to look at phone, surely, and make sure our sleep quality is terrible. Come on. You can't let this chance pass you by. It's rumored that Okumura Foods exploits their employees. Stuff like underpaying staff to reduce labor costs. That's how they have so many stores. What's up? Yo. Why are you here? Just hear me out. The guy I'm rooming with went and brought his girlfriend back to the room. It felt totally awkward staying in there with him. I'm just gonna sleep here tonight. Even though there are only two beds? Coming! Takamaki? The girl I was sharing a room with took off to her boyfriend's room. I know that feeling. And she took the key. I stepped outside for just a second and the auto lock kicked in. I can't get back in my room. Huh? You're looking at stuff online even over here? Ever since the Medjet case, many people from overseas have been accessing the website. Isn't it crazy? The Phantom Thieves are finally making their worldwide debut. Oh, what should I do about overseas requests? I don't think we're the ones you should ask about that. They took down Medjet. I wonder who they'll bring justice to next. It's not just Japan anymore. The whole world's waiting to see the Phantom Thieves' next move. That reminds me, what time is it? <sighs> oh, so sleepy. I'm feeling pretty pooped. You think this could be that jet lag thing? It'll be too much hassle for me to go anywhere else. I'll just sleep in here tonight. Wait, what? I don't I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> Which they can't go back. Are you serious though? <laughs> don't worry, I trust you guys. I mean, sure. I saw that one coming. There are only two beds. Even if someone sleeps on the sofa. One of us is gonna have to sleep on the floor. So who's that gonna be? Oh, hey, playing cards. Why don't we use these to decide? Yes! What? I'm all the way in Hawaii, and I'm stuck sleeping on the floor. Hey, where'd Mishima go? He's in the bathroom. Ain't he been in there a while? The school trip. Shiho was really looking forward to this. On. Sorry. I didn't mean to bring the mood down, but it's already been almost six months since then, hasn't it? <laughs> this all feels so strange. Right? Hard to believe the rowdy kids at school are now famous all over the world. Don't you think we still have a lot to learn about each other, though? You know, things like what kind of people we like. So, time to come clean, Ryuji. Me? Uh, well... She's got to have a good personality. I'm okay with anyone who's modest and nice. What about if two girls with equally good personalities confess to you at the same time? If they're equally nice, uh, then it'd have to be the one with the hotter bod. So looks are what's most important to you. What? Your first answer was just superficial. The second answer was your true beliefs. Huh. So you really are that kind of guy. That ain't fair! What about you? Come on, spill the beans. What kind of girl is your type? <laughs> well, we're just gonna... This is actually the point in time when the correct answer, I feel, is to just say, one with a great body. <laughs> because it's just blowing past the sentence. Do you know what I mean? It's blowing past it. She's gonna assume what she wants. The traps have already been set and Ryuji fell for it. This is where you say that to just... Get past it.
I'm almost really tempted to put that in. I've got one who's really smart. <laughs> to see if she rags on me too. Wait, are you talking about her? Well, we answered honestly. It's your turn next. So, what kind of guy do you... So, what kind of guy do you... My stomach! Uh, uh... That doesn't sound good. You know, wasn't he drinking the tap water earlier? That's like the one thing you're not supposed to do when you're out of the country. You could hear it. No, I believe that is a wise decision. Though it was some third-rate tabloids article. Unnecessary information was leaked after all. Besides, his investigation of the Phantom Thieves showed no progress since then. Yes, there's a possibility that he'll betray us out of spite since he was let go. Well then, we'll make it so that it was a heart attack. As usual, he'll be left to deal with the... Oh, I wouldn't have thought of that. Well played, sir. It no longer matters if we deal with one or two of those connected to us. Seventy-one point six percent. Win up again. <sighs> Our trip is almost over, but tomorrow night we'll be in the airplane heading home. Damn it! This isn't how stuff was supposed to go. What do you mean? We ended up walking around, same as we always do in Japan. I mean, we even ate out of freaking Big Bang Burger. It's like we never left. Wine all you'd like, but that's what the trip was supposed to be. But weren't some other guys getting all cozy with their girlfriends or some shit? I think... And that's it! That's what this trip is missing! Come on, we totally gotta get moving during our free time in the afternoon. What are we going to do? Make a once-in-a-lifetime summer memory! Hawaii's famous for its beaches, and, you know, what happens in Hawaii stays in Hawaii. We can get some girls' numbers during the day, then sneak away to him at night. <laughs> you in or what? Me too? It'll be great! Neither of us have girlfriends who'd get mad about it either. I guess it's true, but... Come on, I know you're acting all cool, but you're totally coming with. No question about it. Ooh, you get a message? Who could that... Uh, actually, you don't gotta answer that. It might be something about you-know-what. Come on, Mishima. Let's go. Wait, what just happened? It's only going to be the two of us, Sakamoto? Don't give me that look. We're going to Waikiki. Try and get a little more excited. And... Could that have been a Phantom Thieves message? I should check when there's nobody else around. Go to my smelly room. I love to go for a walk on the beach. We're in Hawaii, after all. I can finally take a break from my job, too. If you don't have any plans, would you like to take a walk with me? Looks like I've received some messages. I heard that Shujin is here in Hawaii, so I want to say hi. Oh, hi! My school is giving us some free time to do as we please. Care to walk along the beach? It might help with new moves. What was that message earlier? Was it from Futaba? Wait, don't tell me. Was it a girl? Multiple girls? Come on, you gotta make memories with us instead. We bombed it on that beach in Japan, after all. It's my last moment of free time. Who should I spend it with? <laughs> I mean, it makes more sense for me to go and meet with Hifumi because there's probably points in this. <laughs> but I'm going to go with Makoto <laughs> because monogamy. <laughs> really? Thank you. Should I wear a swimsuit? Well, see you later. I didn't say you had to, but I'm okay. Being at the beach, I should hurry and change in my swimsuit. It wasn't a choice. Sorry to ask you out here so suddenly. Seems like Makoto has been waiting for me here. Being a chaperone is more difficult than I expected. We've had a lot of meetings. I honestly wanted to contact you earlier, but this is the first free moment I've had. <laughs> Let's enjoy ourselves then. <laughs> That's 
sounds lovely. All right then, let's take a walk. We already just started dating. I can't go in like that. Oh, a food stand. Garlic shrimp. I've heard that's a famous Hawaiian dish. Are you adventurous when it comes to food? Not really. <laughs> okay, it's actually a prompt. <laughs> I mean, garlic stuff sounds ace. I like garlic. Put a whole bulb of garlic into today's lasagna. Um... Uh, yeah, I'm not adventurous when it comes to food. You're like me, then. It makes me sad when I accidentally order something too exotic. Well, let's give it a try. You two from Japan? Uh, yes, we are. How about them phantom thieves, huh? The guys that steal hearts. <laughs> How do you know about them? Heard about it on the news. They're all the rage in Japan, yeah? Seems like we're even making headlines abroad. Say, if you run into them, tell them I say hello. And ask them to change people's hearts so everyone loves shrimp. <laughs> uh, uh, of course. I'll do just that. The owner gave us a heaping pot of extra shrimp. That's amazing. We gazed out over the ocean while we enjoyed the delicate flavors of a foreign country. How beautiful. Oh, it's already so late. My sister would be upset if she saw me laid back like this. To tell you the truth, I wasn't particularly eager to go on this trip. But if it's like this, I think I'd like to come again. <laughs> Chaperone us next year too. She'll be gone. It's been fun. Yeah. Um. I'd like you to have this. A tiki keychain? Oh no, I didn't get you anything. It's a small wooden keychain. Its dignified yet warm expression is reminiscent of Makoto. Is it now? <laughs> it's not the best souvenir, but it will remind you of the memories we made today. They're great memories. <laughs> Thank goodness. Well, we should probably return before it gets dark. <laughs> We're fine like this. I suppose I can't complain about that. The two of us basked in the stunning Hawaiian sunset. Just me and Makoto. Horrible sunburn, though. It was terrible getting dragged around by Sakamoto all day. Do you think I'll have to go through this on future school events as well? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I reckon it was terrible for him too. You all survived, Mishima. Thanks. I guess I didn't exactly turn down the invite either. <sighs> I don't know. It's fun hanging out with Sakamoto, but he might be too different from me. Is getting a girlfriend my only way out of this situation? Well... Anyway, we need to wake up early tomorrow. Let's get some sleep, okay? Hey. Still open for business. Get that cat upstairs. Aww. It's not like anyone's coming in anyway. Plus, if someone does come, you can just tell them it's a cat cafe. You know that line's not gonna work. Excuse me? Hey. What did I tell you? Get that cat out of here! I'm sorry! Oh no, please, there's no need. I I'm sorry! Huh, wait a sec, it's... I was told that, um, Soldokun is lodging at a cafe, and I just happen to be passing by, so... Uh -huh. ah, I see, you teach at school, huh? Not really, I'm just a counsellor. Well, in any case, I apologize for the cat. Normally, he stays upstairs. It's fine by me. I love animals. They don't seem to share the sentiment, though. <laughs> mm. What's he doing here? Oliver's is off on his little trip. No clue. He's just some alien-level stranger to me. Say, you talk with your cat. That's so neat. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, did I frighten you? My apologies. I just found it impressive, is all. <sighs> Sorry about the cold shoulder over there. 
Just take the cat upstairs, okay? I'll call you back down when it's all clear. Come on, Futaba. We'll just be in the way down here. Let's go. <gasps> that book. Oh, this. It's on a subject called cognitive science. Any interest? <laughs> what? You're... I'm sorry, but you need to leave. Don't worry about the bill. Huh? Huh? I I'm so sorry if there was anything I... The cafe is now closed. I'll have to ask you to... So, Jiro... I'm okay. He stays. What good is driving your few customers away gonna do you anyhow? Utaba. <laughs> so, so, so that book... Is it what you teach, uh, sir? I mean, mister? Hmm. Oh, uh, well... Eh, no, not at all. I'm not a teacher. What's it for, then? It's just a personal interest of mine. I've been studying it for years now. It's difficult to grasp at times, but it's quite useful. Fun to study, too. It's fun. Yeah. Of course, it's a wonderful division of science that can help many people. That makes it pretty fun, right? <laughs> yeah, yep. Mum thought the exact same thing. Mum? Her mother studied it, too. What I don't get is why you're studying something like that, though. Well, you are a high school counsellor, right? I guess it does make some sense, being related to your field and all. Your mum thought that too, huh? She sounds like a wonderful woman. <laughs> oh yeah, my mum own. She loved me so much. <sighs> Past tense. Ah, uh, I see. Right. Well, I'm sure she'd be very proud. All right. Come on, let's Mona. Go. Let's go. Off to amend this room. Hey, wait. <laughs> Fatava, you forgot about... Sorry about that. Would you care for another? <laughs> Thank you. Your coffee truly is amazing. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Man, being sure are changing around here. It's not a manless room up there. The school trip is finally coming to a close. I never thought I would have the chance to go on one this year as well. Barely even felt like I was out of the country, though. Even Yusuke showed up. I'm simply glad the storm didn't make its way over here. It may not have been the most exciting trip, but we still had a good time. Honestly, though, I'm thankful we didn't have to deal with the storm. They truly are dreadful. So, what did you end up doing yesterday? You keeping secrets from me? That's against the bro code! <laughs> It's right there. I went to the beach. What, by yourself? No way I'm gonna believe that. The desperation in your face is quite unbecoming, Ryuji. That's enough, you guys. It felt like this trip went by in a flash. I'm not sure if I want to go home or stay here longer at this point. Hey, why don't we shop for souvenirs together before it's time to go? Ooh, count me in. Allow me to join you as well. Although I have no funds for souvenirs. You're going to be able to get back to Japan, right? What do you think Morgana and Futaba would like? The traditional souvenir from Hawaii is usually chocolate. Oh, but Morgana can't eat chocolate. Well, he tells us that he's not a cat, so maybe it's fine? If we're gonna get them souvenirs, we gotta pick stuff they'll really wig out over. Why don't we split up and look around then? Look! They have coffee with butter in it. Do you think it tastes good? There's acai powder over here. Doesn't it feel like you could just spend forever at places like these? I don't know what you mean. We've come all the way to Hawaii. I think it'd be best for our gifts to focus on impact rather than taste. Oh, well said. In that case... Let's find something we wouldn't buy ourselves, but we'd be happy to get as a gift. I'm not seeing anything. I mean, this is Futaba and Morgana we're talking about. Their standards for happiness are way too high! Yusuke, you find something? An hourglass that measures three-minute increments. Uh, why? 
Well, Futaba loves instant yakisoba. It brilliantly meets the requirements of an item I wouldn't buy for myself, but would please me to receive. But can't she just buy one of those in Japan? Oh crap, we're almost out of time! Okay, Yusuke and I will find Futaba's souvenir and we'll leave Morgana's to you. Something Morgana would like. I feel like someone's staring at me from behind. Hello? Senpai! How's everyone here? <laughs> it's fine. We all these people that leave all end up in the same places anyway. And even when we're left, everyone starts gravitating to our other place. <sighs> General Kenobi? Aloha. <laughs> That's a much more appropriate greeting. Aloha. Huh? Who's that? Find anything suitable? Hmm? That girl. Ah, sorry to be a bother. I'm Yoshizawa, a first year. It's nice meeting you all. Oh, you're that gymnast. Yes, that's right. Our club is here at a training camp to get ready for the next big meet, and I just happened to find him. The last meet was only a short while ago, though. You're already training for the next one? You seem to be making quite the effort. Well, I absolutely have to get the results I'm looking for at the next competition. The team's been training with a famous coach who lives here on the island. She's working us especially hard. We end up in tears almost every day. Your dedication to training even when overseas is admirable. We should all learn from your example. Yep. Good luck at the next meet. We're all rooting for you. Thank you. Your kind words may be what keeps me from crying today. Hey, uh, it's fine if you do cry, though. You know what they say, what doesn't thrill you makes you stronger. Ah, I almost forgot we're out of time here. Uh, well, I'm gonna go pay for my stuff. Ooh, I ought to do that, too. See you later, Yoshizawa-san. Yes, it was nice meeting you all. Your friends seem like a fun bunch. <laughs> They're weird. That's how I describe friends. They're great. Mm -hmm. I think so too. Well, I know I'm going to win for sure this time. I'll prove to everyone what I'm made of. Considering the rank I got last time, though, I also got this souvenir as a sort of insurance. Yeah. Good luck, Charm, eh? I bought it earlier today at this branch of a Japanese shrine here in Hawaii. I always used to buy some kind of charm before a big competition. My sister was even more stringent with her own superstitions. The thing is, I forgot to pick one up before the last meet. I'll be fine now, though. I just know it. I should probably get going. I almost forgot that I still need to pick up souvenirs for my family. Sorry for keeping you so long. I'll see you later. All right. Off we go then. So Jiro's the flight attendant. Would you like some coffee? 